All right, at 617, we take a look in Lawrence and mainly cloudy throughout this day today. Beginning to see the clouds thin out in spots. It's going to be a slow change, and in fact, tomorrow it's not going to be cloud free, but it is going to be so much warmer. 50 degrees now in Lawrence, up from 49 where you've spent most of the day. And our Peace Center sky cam showing things very overcast. The winds have been quite calm, and now we're seeing that shift out of the south just at three miles per hour. That southerly breeze tapping into a little bit of moisture, and with that low level moisture and the light winds, we'll watch out for some fog developing overnight. 52 now in Asheville with a few breaks in the clouds and fewer breaks throughout the upstate. It's going to work its way down here as far as some of that clearing goes as we'll have an area of high pressure at the surface working in and we're going to stay mainly dry the next couple of days and notably warmer. We've had high pressure and the northeasterly flow around it in the mid and upper levels and that has kept us so so cloudy and temperatures so much below average with a cold front on the way. And some of that Gulf moisture in place, wringing out some rain in the deep south, and that will continue tomorrow as this continues to move in our direction. As far as us getting any rain from it, the earliest will come in late day on Thursday. So while tomorrow morning we could have a little misty drizzle out of some low clouds, so it could be a little slick start to the morning. We're not talking about much in the way of rain again until uh, Thursday, and that would be later in the day. So big difference in the temperatures. There is quite a bit of cold air behind this as it clears through here just in time for our holiday weekend. The good news is it is going to sweep on through. In fact, through the day, uh, first half of the day on Friday coming in. Now it'll take a little while to clear out, a little longer in the mountains even, but the shower chances will wrap up and we're going to find drying conditions into Saturday and Sunday. Good stuff. Many areas we're talking just a trace of rain as this comes through, but a little more dynamics over western North Carolina. We could squeeze out close to an inch of rain, but certainly not any sort of problematic levels as far as the rain goes. Here are temperatures today by 10 a.m. will be warmer than we've been the past several days, and then the temperatures will continue to go up as we will get more sunshine through here. Now for tomorrow in the mountains again, those clouds are going to be a bit stubborn, but it's still going to warm you up nicely with that shift in the winds, and we'll find temperatures easily close to 70 degrees all across West Western North Carolina 72 in the upstate for tomorrow a little bit warmer even on Thursday with the increasing rain chance late goes as high as about 70% in the overnight between Thursday and Friday and then some slow clearing on Friday again in time for Easter weekend bringing in some drier air and temperatures just about average levels into the upper 60s for highs. We'll start out next week bringing a rain chance back in with temperatures on the cooler side once again. So happy to bring you at least a few 70s for this week. Yes, yeah, not 52 though, is it? No, it is not. Yeah. <laughs> Pamela, thank you. Yeah.